Hello and welcome. My name is Diana Eakins and I'm the Video Production Assistant at Media Bistro. Today we're going to talk about how to create an online portfolio. Your portfolio is a showcase of your work, your skills, and your potential. If you're a media professional, you'll want to share your work with your prospective clients, employers, and colleagues in your field. It's easy to create an online portfolio. The hard part is making it good. Let's go through some tips that will help you get started to showcase your work. First, ask yourself what you would like your online portfolio to accomplish. Which would best serve your needs? A website, a blog, or a community-based page? If you simply want an online home for your work samples, a website is a must. If you want to establish credibility within the industry, a blog will provide you a platform to keep readers coming back to read your insights. If you want to get feedback on your work and network with peers, you'll want to register with a community-based site. If you want to accomplish all three of these goals, use all three platforms or a combination site. Take the time to map out your game plan. Keep it simple. Simplicity is the key to good web design. Make sure your site is easy to navigate. An elaborate flash intro may be impressive, but people will probably skip it or click away altogether. Although you may have lots of work to show, try to pick four or five of your favorite pieces of recent work to showcase. Don't be modest on your about page. Try to answer all the questions that potential clients and employers might have about you. This is your opportunity to convince them that you're the right person for the job. Let them know who you are, what kind of work you do, where you were educated, and what your qualifications are. Adding testimonials from previous clients will assure them that you are a reliable professional. Provide clear contact information. Your viewers shouldn't have to search for it. This could be your deal maker or your deal breaker. Have your contact information in more than one place on your site. Better yet, include a Hire Me button that allows people to contact you about a job with one click. Link it. Make sure you link your online portfolio to your LinkedIn, your Facebook, and Twitter. You never know who's going to take a peek. This is also a great way for a friend to easily recommend you. Show off only the skills that you're selling. It's great that you're a graphic designer and a DJ, but if you want to land that design freelance job, create a separate website for any other creative work. Don't be afraid of a little SEO. Search engine optimization, or SEO, is the process of improving the visibility of a website in search engines by using certain keywords. Say you're a web designer. I'm a web designer working out of New York City. Potential clients will probably be searching Google for New York City web designer. Incorporate this word string into your title bar, into your about page, and so on. Thanks for watching. If you'd like to learn more about creating an online portfolio, including a tour of some of the best sites out there, check out the full version of this tutorial at mediabeaster.com slash on demand. For more information on SEO, click here to watch a Media Bistro how-to video on this topic.